Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am back again with another palette testing. I'll be testing out the Revolution Bratz Chloe palette today. I've already done an Sasha, I've already done Yasmin, and now I think it's time to switch up and play with some blues. I really like the look of this. It looks very cool tone, very, very on theme for the winter, I'd say. I'd say Chloe is the palette with the least depth shades. A lot of it's quite light, I'd say. They look stunning. My lips are absolutely stinging right now. I've just put on this lip plumper. What is it? Um, oh my god, my lips are on fire. Too Faced Lip Injection X oh, Extreme, and they are extreme. I can feel it extreme. So yeah, I'll be testing out the palette. I'll also be using one of the lipstick or lip glosses from the Lip Vault. Um, I don't. I think I might go over nude because we're playing with blues. Yeah, and this is also a Chloe lipstick as well, so it just makes sense to go with the nude. So, yeah, if you're interested to see what the lipstick is like with this palette, what Chloe's palette is like in general, then carry on watching. Hit subscribe if you don't want to miss out on Jade's palette. But yeah, without further ado, let's get into Chloe. That sounds wrong. Palette are stinging! Right. By the way, I'm not doing full faces with these palettes. I just want to do the video concentrating on these palettes. Um, but I have just used the eye. I, but I have just used the eye. But I have. I cannot speak. I have just used the I Hot Revolution Elf Primer, and yeah, just put that on. This is my second video I'm filming today, and I've just been on a massive walk, and I just, I'm just not thinking straight. I don't know what's going on. Right, let's get into this palette. I'm going to prime my eyes first using the Beauty Bay Eye Base. I'd love to know which palette is your favourite. If you've brought the Vols, have you tried all the palettes yet? What is your favourite? I think Sasha still sticks at number one so far. Um, we've still got to try Jade yet. But yeah, Sasha has really surprised me with hers because I didn't think I was going to like it because it's green and you know how I feel about green. So I'm just going to put a base colour down first. I'm going to use Tell Me Everything. I have done swatches on this palette by the way. It's in my first Bratz video unboxing. So if you want to see the whole swatches of all the palettes that are in that video. So yeah, I'm just going to go in Tell Me Everything all in the crease. I'm glad there is a dark brown in this palette, um, hottie alert. So, because I feel like if we didn't have that brown, we'd be struggling a bit of what looks to do, so. Even though I'm not gonna be using that brown today, but I know that brown will come in handy someday. I'm also gonna take Way Cute as well. This, it's a bit darker than the color we got down. nice shade of color to put down yes right so now i'm gonna go with outer blue this is i think pretty sure this is a shimmer i think it's a satin actually this uh, this um outer blue shade does come off satin um can you see i'm gonna put that on the inner corner and out the corner i'm gonna do a halo with this today And that is popping, popping real good. It's like an electric blue, suits the cover. I'm just gonna smooth the outer corners a bit. I'm also gonna take that on the lower lash line as well. I'm also gonna take a smaller brush. I'm gonna take a bit of treasures and also put that in my crease. I'm glad we got a light blue shade to blend out. How on earth did I get blue up there? 
So I want to make this quite dark. I'm going to use Living It Up and Formal Funk. What should I? Yeah, let's try that. So I'm going to put this on the outer corner and the inner corner. This could make it a bit darker. Bit of a grungy blue. Okay, so now I'm just going to put a bit of concealer in the middle. And now let's play with the shimmer. Right, so I really like the look of denim jacket, which is this shade. This could look really nice. This feels so soft. Oh my God, that looks so nice. Let me see what that looks like in the middle. Ooh. Whoa. That is so nice. I'm gonna take a bit of Dreamy and just put that in the middle as well. Just a touch of it. Cause this could really brighten up the middle. Woo! Okay, so for the inner corner, I'm gonna take, should I take a bit of Dreamy again? Oh, I don't know. Um, wings. Wings is an interesting color. You know what, I'm gonna go wings. Cause this could be interesting. Ooh. That is such a nice shade, Wings. You know Wings was actually the shade that I was a bit meh when I first watched it on the video, but it applies on beautifully. It's like a duochrome. Yeah, that's so unique. See, you can't always judge by the swatches because that's just applied on really nice. Oh my God, I am loving this palette so far. Oh, she is coming through. Chloe is coming through. I think she's beating Yasmin at this point. Right, I am gonna go off camera, do the other eye, and then we can come back. Try out a gloss. Try out Chloe's gloss. She's got a, a nudie one. Yeah, she's got this one. So this could look nice. I bet the pink could look nice as well. We've already tried the pink. We've already tried the pink. Ooh. We've already tried the pink or well, this one. No, we're going to go for the nude. I've just been having a nightmare with my base. I've literally chucked out the MUA base, that new foundation that I tried the other day. I said I really liked it, but the second time I tried it, I don't like it. I've chucked it away. Yeah, this one, I just, it's too thick. I mean, it, just look at that. The consistency is thick. That's not me doing that. That's just done that just applying it on my face oh my god why did i say i like this again I, I swear to god like first impressions when you do first impressions you like something and then the second time you try it it's just like i don't like this anyway let's get on to the gloss so chloe's gloss the nude let's go with this chunky i think this will look nice with this look i'm hoping Right. My lips are gonna hate me after this week. Just matte lipstick overload. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Right, the chapped as it is. What a gorgeous color. I really like this one. My least favourite lipstick from that set is the pink, um, but this, this could be my everyday lippy, I like it. Doesn't feel drying yet, hmm, I can feel it drying down now. So this is the lipstick fully dried. They are a bit sticky, but not like too bad, um, I can live with this. This feels really comfy, yeah I do like this. It's a good formula. It's weird, like I feel like they're a bit inconsistency with the dry, with how it feels on the lips. Like the Yasmin lipstick felt really dry, but this feels absolutely fine. I'm gonna hop off camera, put some lashes on, and I'm gonna tell you my final thoughts on the Chloe. Oh my God, those lashes took so long to put on. I was thinking I might put this gloss on. This is the Sasha Clear Gloss. So I think this could look nice with the nude. I think it has got shimmer particles in. Mm. 
Yeah, it's got a, a bit of shimmer particles you know I can see on camera. But yeah, that feels so moisturizing. So what do we think of Chloe's palette? Um, yeah, I'm obsessed with this look. I absolutely love it. This is probably my second favorite palette under Sasha. And yeah, it's just it's just a really fun palette. I bet you could do so many cool looks with this as well. I really like the Sasha Clear Gloss on top of the Chloe lipstick. I thought those two were a good match. Um, absolutely love the denim jacket shade. Denim jacket shade is oh, it's probably my favorite blue ever. It is so pretty. Can't get over that. So it is a yes from me using the Chloe palette. I can't really fault the colours that I've used today. I will do another look with it in the meantime. I want to try do like a greyish tone look because um, I never know how to use grey eyeshadow. If you use grey eyeshadow, what do you, how do you use it? Because I'd love to know. I want to try out grey eyeshadow. I really like that they've chose these colours well. They all, they all match with each other, I think. And it's nice to do a neutral look as well if you don't want to do any blue. Yeah, I really like that they've put greys with the blues because I do like grey and blue together. So yeah, that is my tutorial today. Testing out the Chloe palette and her lipstick and a clear gloss from Sasha. Even though I've ruined the day foot now because it's gone over my lipstick and it's... Yeah, it's going to go weird colour that is now but yeah i hope you enjoyed it do let me know in the comments what you think of this what you think of the palette have you tried it yet did you get the vault hopefully it's on sale for black friday so you could get your hands on it for even cheaper but yeah before i go if you did like this video please do give it a big thumbs up it sure helps my channel out. and also if you don't want to miss out on the palette review for jade which i need to look at it again so this is jade's palette i think hers is more pinky purple movie Ooh, love the look of that. Such nice colours in that. I have no idea what look to do with this. Prom night looks like a marbly shade. That looks stunning. Uh, yeah. Mmm. Glam. This is gonna be glam. But yeah, turn the notification bell on if you don't want to miss out on Jade's palette, of course. And yeah, hope you have a lovely day. Not time watching this, and I shall see you in the next one. Bye.